We are developing news tonight. Federal officials investigating after a single engine plane crash earlier tonight. This happened in Colleton County. News 2's Lexi Moore is joining us live from the Medical University. And Lexi, two people were on board. One person was airlifted to MUSC for his injuries. Yeah, that's right, Brendan. Culleton County officials say around 4 p.m. this evening they responded to a plane crash in Walterboro. Now we do know there were two people on the plane. The pilot is suffering several traumatic injuries, and we're still working to learn more on the condition of the passenger. We were notified that um, four minutes after four this afternoon from the Lowcountry Regional Airport of a possible plane that went down. According to Colleton County Fire and Rescue, the single-engine Piper PA-32R300 plane crashed near Roundo Road in Walterboro with two people on board. It was on the ground. Uh, there were pieces of it in the trees, and uh, it did break apart. Units were out there for I mean, about three hours. Officials say the plane had broken up a bit, leaving parts scattered among the trees and at one point catching fire. They carried fire extinguishers into the woods and then they ended up stretching about 600 feet of uh, hose into the woods to uh, finish putting it out. Officials say the pilot was airlifted to MUSC after apparently being ejected. Multiple trauma injuries and uh, burns. And, uh, he was treated at the scene by the fire the paramedics and then uh, fire rescue transported into a nearby field and we called the uh, Medicare helicopter out of Charleston. The Federal Aviation Administration says this is an ongoing investigation. We do know that the passenger was a female. We're just working to learn more about her identity. We'll keep you updated on air and online over on Count2.com. Reporting live in downtown Charleston, I'm Lexi Moore, Count2.